Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to determine the infinite limit, the limit as x approaches 3 from the right of ln of x squared minus 9. So how do we do this? Well, let's just plug in our value into the function. So this is going to be equal to approaching 3 from the right squared minus 9. So if we're approaching 3 from the right, that means we have values that are slightly greater than 3. So squaring them is going to give us values that are slightly greater than 9. Subtracting 9, taking values that are slightly greater than 9, and subtracting 9 means we're going to get values that are slightly greater than 0. So the inner function goes to 0. So this is basically the um, value of the natural log as it approaches zero. What does that actually mean? Well, this is log base e of values getting closer and closer to zero. Let's just say this is equal to some y. This is going to be the equal to the value of the whole limit. So we have to solve for y. We know e to the y is equal to this value, which again might be a little bit complicated, but this is just saying we're getting closer and closer to zero. And for a, an exponential to be getting closer to, closer to zero, that means that this fraction, or sorry, this um, exponent has to be getting greater and greater in the negative direction, right? So if you think about um, e squared, right? e to the negative two is one over e squared. e to the negative 10 is one over e to the 10th, right? So these denominators are getting bigger and bigger as the exponent gets smaller and smaller, which means it's getting closer and closer to zero, right? So y is approaching negative infinity. So this whole function is approaching negative infinity.